How you guys doing? This is going to be a tutorial on how to jailbreak your iPhone with Snowbreeze version 1.5 to jailbreak 3.1.3. Uh, the first thing you have to do is download this firmware here, which is uh, for the iPhone 3G 3.1.3. I'll put the description and the link on the side there. The way you can just click on it and download it into your desktop. Then you have to download Snowbreeze version 1.5. I also put a description, I put a, a link in the description on the side, that way you guys can just click on it and download. But let's start. First thing you do is open Snowbreeze 1.5. Okay, just click OK. Here it says Snowbreeze version 1.5 for 3.1.3. Click on this arrow. Uh, check where it's ex expert mode. Click on that. Go to next. Browse for the IPSW. Which, that's the file that I just told you to download the original Apple IPSW file. So we would browse that. I have it on my desktop. It's right here. Now it's processing. Okay, once it finds it, it's going to look something like this. iPhone 3G, it's got a check mark. It's already got it. It's verified. Click Next. Now, pick where it says General and go to the arrow. Now, for those guys that don't want to use anybody else but AT&T, if you just want to jailbreak your phone and not unlock it, uh, do not check on Activate the Phone. Leave that off. If you do want to unlock it, then you need to activate the phone. So leave that checked and add this add Snowbreeze iPhone app. Make sure those two are checked off. Make sure the one in the middle is blank. Go to that arrow. Here where it says unlock. If you have an iPhone 3G, you will use this black snow. Click on that. It's not going to let you because 3.1.3 is not unlockable at the moment. So this is only going to jailbreak your phone. I have another video out there that shows you guys how to downgrade your, your bootloader. That way you can unlock it. Click the blue arrow. Here's Cydia. For those of you guys wanting to know how to get Cydia on your phone, all you do is just make sure this has got a check mark on it, and this will un un this will install Cydia on your iPhone. You don't have to do anything here. Just go to the arrow. Now this is for people that want this boot logo different. Instead of the Apple, you can have a snowflake, and the recovery instead of just a uh, the USB cord that says iTunes, you have this. I don't prefer to like this, so I just take it off. I uncheck that and leave that off. Once, If you take these off, you will have the original Apple logo and the original iTunes recovery logo on there. The blue arrow. Now I'm done. Now all I have to do is come check off build IPSW and the blue. Now Snowbreeze is creating a custom firmware for me that's going to be activated and jailbroken for iPhone 3G Okay, you guys, this is what it looks like when it's done. That's it. It jailbroke and created your custom firmware. Just close out of here. And this is it right here. Your Okay, guys, here's the Snowbreeze custom firmware, 3.G IPSW. Here's the one for the jailbroken one, and here's the Apple one. You no longer need that one. Put that to the side. The next thing you have to do is go to the link I'm going to put here in my description for I Hate Snow iRib. This is it right here. Download that from the description link that I'm going to put on the side. Once you downloaded that, open that. This will show you how to put your phone 
in DFU mode and in case you have any errors uh, here's uh, I hate snow so you would have to put your phone on DFU mode which will do it like this first you gotta make sure your phone is plugged into your computer then you gotta make sure your phone is turned off then you gotta follow these steps here Once you've done that, you've successfully done the DFU mode. Once it's in DFU mode, do not open iTunes yet. Click here where it says iPhone 3G. Once that's, cl once that's clicked on, this I hate snow will crash. That is normal. Once, it's, once it crashes and your phone will turn, your screen will turn white. Then you can go ahead and open iTunes where it says restore. Press shift on your keyboard and hold it. Click restore and then look for the snow breeze IPSW which is this one that you just created on your desktop click on that select it and then iTunes will start restoring your phone with this firmware here instead of the original Apple Apple firmware after that your phone will be jailbroken on 3.1.3 watch my other video if you need to downgrade your uh, bootloader to unlock it please only do 3.1.3 if you know that you don't want it unlocked you just want to jailbreak it because you cannot unlock every single phone only the phones with bootloaders 05.08 will be able to downgrade the baseband on if you don't have 05.08 then you will not be able to downgrade your baseband and it won't be unlocked there's not an unlock out yet so please do the same steps I did but with version 3.1.2 and you guys will be okay there's an unlock for the baseband that's out which is 0511 that's out right now uh, that's simple that's it uh, you guys uh, have a good day and leave me any comments thank you